Today, we are going to talk about why live videos are going to help your business and how to use tags to increase more views. And that's coming up next. Good morning, everybody. Happy Tuesday. Let's go ahead and get on with this exciting day today. So in a moment, I'm going to go ahead and uh, sh um, introduce myself to Instagram. But first, let me make sure my everything is working here. You guys uh, should be able to hear me just fine. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Thank you again for always watching the recordings, uh, always showing up uh, to the live events. Thank you. I appreciate that. So comments and reactions are on and volume is good to go. All right. So today, basically, I will be actually sharing my screen. So for those of you who are not on Facebook Live with me, um, you can always find me there. Just go to facebook.com forward slash optimistic marketer. All right. Let's get going with this. And cool all right so i'm gonna in a moment right here i'm gonna go ahead and uh start with instagram so here we go instagram hey everybody this is eddie sen your optimistic marketer today i'm gonna show you why live videos are going to improve your business results and how to use tags to get more eyes watching you that's coming up next okay let's do this good morning everybody good morning thank you again for watching here live today it's a good day it is the day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it. I hope you are choosing to be glad in this day because it is up to you. You can control how you feel, and you can control the outcome of your situation. It's all up here, right? So today, today is all about tags. Did you know that you can actually use tags on your live streaming videos? And let me tell you a little bit about tags and why you need them. So basically, tags, think of it this way. Tags are like keywords. When someone is searching for your business, they're, unless they know you, okay, unless they know you, the name of your business, they're not going to be searching so much for the name, right? They're, if, if they're not your customers yet, if they're not your clients yet. What they're going to be searching for a lot of times is keywords an example is fajitas right so uh, by the way today's my uh, my wife's birthday and i've got some surprises for her already this morning that's why i'm excited to go back and follow through with this amazing birthday for her and one of the things that she likes is fajitas so i've got to go and pick them up at a restaurant but see the way if if i did i know that restaurant i know where it's at i always go there and i pick up now that we need to pick up we're not going to be staying inside but if you don't know the name of the restaurant what you would do is you would look up on your phone and start typing fajitas fajitas near me well facebook has the same type of option the only difference is that when you go on facebook you know where you at the very top if you search for a keyword, fajitas, then you're going to come up with every single post if they have those tags included in the post, including videos. If they don't have those tags and they're not using them right, then it's they're going to not even show up on the first few um, results. So you see tags on Facebook are really important because as I'm telling you right now, you've got to do live videos. But how do you how do you outreach? How do you go in and have an outreach in your market? By tags. You add the tags. Now you've got to be specific about those tags, though. All right. Don't don't become the Instagram uh, uh, in past like in a couple in a few years ago. A few years ago, uh, in in Instagram, you can add about thirty. I don't know if you still can, but if you can, don't don't do it either right now. But you could add 30 tags to your post, to your image, right? So what happened then is that people, they started to post up to 30 tags and no content. It was just a bunch of tags. And some of the tags had nothing to do with their posts. Don't do that here. Uh, as a matter of fact, you only have you can only add eight eight tags 
to your live videos, eight tags. What I recommend is use between two and three. And when you use them, use them specifically to the topic that you are search that you are talking about that you're going live for. However, here's the catch. Here is here's some things you need to learn, and I'm going to show you this today. Uh, so again, if you're not with me on Facebook Live, go and find me there at facebook.com forward slash optimistic marketer because I'm going to show you in a moment the the behind the scenes. I'm going to show you how to actually get this tax in your post in your live streaming post. But anyway, um, but what you need to know is that there are tags that Facebook recommends and that those are the ones that you need to use. There are other times when the keyword is not there, the, the, the tag is not there. Even if you type it, it doesn't come up. You could, and, and this is where um, I don't actually understand the, the algorithm behind it or, or the computerized part of this. But what I've done is, and I'll show you today, that sometimes you can type a tag and it'll stay. Other times it won't. Basically, if I type, and I'll show you, when I type, for example, marketing, and I want that tag to stay there, even though it's not an option of recommended tags, it won't. It just won't go there. Other times there are some other words that I've typed and it stayed. So again, you're going to have to play around with this and test it out and see how it works for you. But the main point of using tags, especially for your live videos right now, is so that people can find you first. The more you put, the more specific tags you have, the better for you in searches. And that's what's happening right now. So another thing, by the way, if you don't know this yet, Good morning, everybody. Thank you for watching. Hey, Natalie. Good morning. Good morning, Patricia. Oh, Marta Patricia. What is up? <laughs> and Natalie. Awesome. Thank you guys for showing up. I appreciate it. But tags are very important, right? And what most uh, businesses, if, if you don't know this yet, I, I'm telling you, I've been doing this live videos every day, Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, 7 a.m. Pacific for the past three months. And why I've done that is because I want to bring value to the business community, especially in this unprecedented times. However, because they're unprecedented times, that doesn't mean they're all bad. They are good times too. There is a huge opportunity being open right now, especially this month. About There is a marketing shift happening in social media, especially here on Facebook. So if you're not watching me on Facebook, Go ahead yourself over there and watch me there. So, but Facebook, there's some changes happening. But overall, in all the social media platforms, online marketing, a huge marketing shift is happening. And you as a business owner, you have the opportunity today to ride this wave of, I call it the virtual push, because we're being pushed into the virtual world. You've got this opportunity to ride the wave and get your business online. Expand your business if you already have a physical business or a business already and you haven't used social media or online marketing to the fullest, this is your time. Or for those of you who are starting out, who you thought a few months ago, maybe last year, you thought, you know, one day I want to start an online business and I want to do this and stay home and make money or whatever it is that you thought about, this is your time. Jump in and do it now. And how do you start? By doing live videos. All right. So that is the reason why I'm going to show you today how to actually tag your videos so that you can get more eyes on your business. Cool. All right. Awesome. Oh, uh, mm. uh, my God. I'm drinking my Hawaiian coffee today, by the way. It's so good. It's it's a medium roast but you can tell there's some citrus uh, uh, taste to it. It's so, so good. Love it. Mm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right. Um, cool. Now, uh, let me go ahead and get started with this. Oh, I'll leave you with this if uh, before I go in and show you how to do the tags. Just remember, I've left this up here because this is the most important part of how you want to get started, especially with live streaming. 
all right? You want to, I call it the digital marketing path, all right? This is the path you want to take. Uh, and what's happening, if you notice, is everything is about them. Everything is about your market. Everything is about your audience. There's only one you in this part, okay? That means that you've got to work as three times as hard to give your audience what they want, and then later on, they will ask you what you have. They will come to you as the go-to person or as the go-to business and buy from you. And it takes them knowing you, then it takes them liking you, then it takes them to trust you. And why knowing you is important? Because that's how you build trust. It's a relationship. And how can you do that right now in this marketing shift, this virtual marketing shift? Through live streaming, through live video. Be all you can be, who you are, on live, right here, live. And trust me, people will come. I have so many of you already who are watching me, even watching the recording. I know you guys are taking action because I see you. I've been there where you're at, at the beginning stages. And now what's happening? I think, Martha, we just had this conversation this weekend, right? You are already getting people asking you to talk about certain topics. You see, it's all about providing, 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 and then people will like you so much that they'll come back and want to watch you more or even further trust you enough to buy from you. Make sense? Cool. So again, one more time, if you are not on Facebook Lab, I'm getting ready to show behind the scenes how to actually add this tax to your posts, specifically live videos, and how is that going to help you and your business get more eyes, more views, which in turn is going to get you more leads and eventually more sales. And I'm going to do that right now. If you're not on Facebook, follow me, facebook.com forward slash optimistic marketer. And here we go. All right, so let's share my screen. Now, here's what you want to do. I'm going to go ahead and pick one, uh, one of the videos that I've done. And let me go over here. All right. So, oh, no, that's the one that I'm on right now. So, as usual, right, whenever I'm live, most of the time, it, there's a little lag between what I'm showing you. Oh, look at this. You see this uh, right here? That's Steve right there, y'all. That is Steve, Getting Gear Steve. Uh, and that is his live video. He's, he's the guy who I've been talking to you about for the past few months, basically, how he did three, four videos. The first week, the fourth day, he started the live videos. He, he didn't feel comfortable enough to start them out, but he did it anyway, just like every one of you, right? And on the fourth day, he sends me a message and he's telling me now he's got, he had two projects already uh, and then, and now it's been over a month and now he's moving into, he's so busy now. He's got multiple projects. He's showing, he should go check him out. Biographics, that's his page. You'll see it here on my page. Go check him out and see what works he's doing. So again, it was all because he went live. He took action. Yeah, so there it is. There is Steve. All right, so let me show you this. Okay, right here. So this one here. What you do is, let's say you pick one of your live streaming, which by the way, it could be one that you have already done in the previous weeks or days or, or weeks, and pick one, whichever it is. I likely, what I do here, for example, there's 54 reach, 26 engagements, 21 views. When I see this, you see how Facebook tells you you can get more likes, comments, and shares? First of all, don't fall for that. That's not, that's not a trap. I don't want to say that's a trap. But there's a, you know, Facebook is, is there to make money. You understand that, right? Facebook is a business. So any chance they, the algorithm sees your videos that they're not getting a lot of views or likes or things like that, it is going to recommend, hey, why don't you pay us? We can get the, the word out for you. So uh, a lot of times though, you don't want to do that because maybe you don't, it's not the right content uh, or a lot of times it's just that you give it time and people will show up, people will view it. So again, don't, don't just follow what Facebook uh, a lot of times will tell you. Um, all right, so let's pick this one. And the way you do it is you go to the edit tools at the very top right corner of your post. And when you open the, uh, click on the three dots, you're going to see edit post. 
So when you see edit post, you click on that and immediately it's going to bring you to the place where you can add a title, title your videos, by the way, you won't see the title on the Facebook feed. However, I'm going to show you here. However, what ha what's happening is that that title becomes your almost your offer, your, your enticement for people to learn more. Uh, so as a matter of fact, you see why I picked this one, social media marketing for small businesses. Uh, you want to write a post, um, whether it is a, a general post that gives in people information, but notice what I've done there too, by the way, you see those, uh, hashtags, Facebook does recognize hashtags now before they did it. Now they do. Um, and then here it is. You see those tags right there? There it is. So this video, and again, look, the social media, that's my title. And yes, this video, I talked about social media. So therefore, I looked up social media. Now, I'm going to do this again because I want you to see what I meant when I described the situation between the Facebook uh, giving you what they recommend and you trying to put your own tags. Watch this. Uh, and by the way, it's up to eight. However, I recommend three. Two to three is good enough. So if I type social media, all right, social media, you see how the option is there? But check this out. What if I want to say marketing? No option. Do you see that? There's no option. But look down here. It says add a new tag, marketing. So I'm going to add it. And there it is. Now watch this now sales okay you see that at the bottom add a new tag you see that uh, tag you click and sales now why do you think they don't recommend this this is something that i had to really dive in and find out why is it that they don't recommend sales they don't recommend marketing well because you know there are some people out there who take advantage of this whole system and they're spammers they're basically spammers all right, they're selling you the latest, greatest new thing, and it's all a scam or spam. <laughs> so Facebook is, very, is being very cautious here. What I would recommend is this. Um, stick with what they recommend, what Facebook recommends. So an example here, I talk to business owners. All right, so there is business news or local and small businesses. I'll choose that. And of course, everybody in business is an entrepreneur. And there you go. That's why I chose those three. But let's say I want to choose, uh, I think this one, oh, going live. So let's say I want to say um, live streaming. Okay, live streaming. So there it is, live stream. There's no tags. I can go ahead and add it. And that will be just fine. But don't get caught up with putting tags that do not fit your post, your video, all right? Be cautious. And like I said, two to three is more than enough. Look, right here, I'm looking at it. Now that I'm thinking with you, four, I think that's good. I, I actually just came up with that right now. So I think that would be really, really good to leave right there. Other than that, don't do eight. Don't, don't do more. All right, so now that's how you do it. And then, of course, the tags, again, will help your viewers find you much quicker uh, and let me leave you with this one last piece here you see where it says distribution i've talked about this before but if you haven't done so make sure you click distribution and you start to create playlist a playlist is just think of it uh, as an ipod right you listen to your playlist and, and in the playlist there's all the exact type of topics within that theme uh, same thing here. So start doing that because again, this basically helps your videos. Let me come back to you here. Give me a moment here. All right. So this help, help, um, help Lily. <laughs> this basically helps your videos, your post to be found by those specific people in your marketplace, right? So, uh, the tags, very important. And you want to do it immediately after you're done with your live videos. I mean, it, you saw me. It doesn't take that much. But again, be very, very cautious about what tags you use and don't fill it with everything. Just put three, two, three. Look, I even added an extra one, four. That's cool. But make it to where it's the exact topic that you're talking about. That's what the tags are all about. 
Uh, and then the playlist, like I showed you, start building your playlist. So make sure you're doing that because again, that also helps people who are searching an example for virtual marketing. So there is a playlist for virtual marketing. Everything underneath there deals about that. So people will actually get there or find it faster. Make sense? All right, awesome. Well, that's there you go. That's what I have for you today. I really hope you're taking advantage of this. And I'm going to remind you, leave you with this and remind you, this is a reminder that right now, this month, yes, the big companies have left for this month, uh, have stopped paying for advertising, promoting their business on Facebook. I'm talking about Coca-Cola, Starbucks. Listen to me. If you're, if you're watching me right now and, or either you are an owner of a coffee shop, or you know someone who has a coffee shop, you better drive to those people that is not Starbucks, drive them, drive to them or talk to them or do whatever you got to do. Get on Facebook, start live streams a lot and start boosting every single video you make. Make sure you give, uh, if you're a coffee shop, make sure you're focusing on the one thing that's going to set you apart from Starbucks. Okay. The one thing, and then live stream how you make that one drink, this one thing that you're making, make it all pretty beautiful. Talk a little bit about it. Make it so cozy and enjoyable, the video, as you're making this one drink, and then boost that video. Five, ten bucks every single week for this whole month. Listen, you will take, you will take a lot of people from Starbucks into your business. I'm telling you now, but you got to do it this month. So for any other one out there who has uh, any type of business, uh, let me see, what was it? Uh, it was Coca-Cola to Pepsi, uh, Microsoft. Uh, anyway, the, the big, big companies, they're not paying. So if you have a small business, get on, get on social media, start doing live streaming and start boosting your videos as, as many as you can, because Think about it. The big guys are not going to take room, the room of the Facebook feeds. They're out, right? They're, they're not going to be showing on people's feeds, but yours will, right? I, I'm telling you, do it. Do it now. This is your opportunity. And this is my excitement, by the way, is this marketing shift. I've seen this before, 2008. Not as, not as much as this, okay? This is there's no comparison on what's happening, the opportunity that, that we have. However, it reminds me of the opportunity that I missed in 2008, right? If you think back, what happened then? I missed that boat, but this one is bigger than ever, ever before, especially with our technology. So get on board. Don't miss the boat. <laughs> this is not a boat. This is a, a, a tank. No, this is a ship. This is a cruise ship. It's not even a boat. <laughs> All right, guys. Glad that you were here. I'm glad that you're still watching. Make sure you take action. That's how it makes me feel good when you guys share your stories, that you've taken action, you've done something with the information that I'm giving you. Be back here tomorrow. Uh, again, Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, 7 a.m. Pacific. I'll be back here until further notice, and I will see you later. Thank you again, everybody. Stay cool, stay calm, and keep a sound mind. Peace.